Hello friend, how are you? I hope you all are doing great in your life. So friend, I welcome you again in my YouTube channel. And today we are going to discuss the third problem of regression. Here we have given some information and we have to just draw two regression equations and also find the value of dependent variable on the basis of non independent. Okay. So in previous lecture we have discussed how to find Vxy and Dyx under direct method means when we have to take deviation by the actual mean and also the second problem when the deviations are taken from assumed mean. Right? So here if the information is given like this how we will find two regression equation and dependent variable on the basis of non-independent one. So in this question we are given two variable here advertisement and the sale okay and uh, the value is given in crores rupees okay so mean of these two variable in case of advertisement it is 20 crores and for sale it is 120 crores the standard deviation this is 4 for advertisement and 12 for sales and correlation between advertisement and the sale okay so between advertisement and the sale is 0.9 right so we are asked to calculate or to estimate two regression equations and number second sales when advertisement is rupees 50 crores and number three advertisement for sales of rupees 150 crore okay so let's start so we will have to first run two regression equation here this is case 1 or regression equation of x on y. Okay. This is you can say 1a. Right? Okay. It is x minus x bar equal to correlation between x and y times standard deviation of x series upon standard deviation of y series times y minus y bar okay now put the values or non values in this equation we get x we don't know but x bar we have 20 okay so let's assume this advertisement as x and sales as y. We are assuming advertisement as x, sales as y. So x minus 20, the mean of x variable is 20, equal to correlation is 0.9, standard deviation of x series is 4, upon standard deviation of y series is 12, times y minus y bar we have 120 okay this is 120 so it is x bar this one is y bar this is standard deviation of x this is standard deviation of y and this one is the correlation between x and y right correlation x and y okay so now simplify this we will get 12.3 so this is 0 0.3 y minus 36 okay 120 into 0.3 it is 36 okay so x minus sorry that will be now x equal to now we will carry this value here with 36 0 0.3 y minus 36 plus 20 okay then x equal to point 3 y minus 16 okay 36 minus 20 it is minus 16 okay so this is our first equation okay and similarly we have to find out the second one okay 
you please just note it down. Okay, so now we will draw the second one. That is regression equation of x on y and now it is y on x. Second regression equation we have y minus y bar equal to r times y minus sorry standard deviation of y upon square root x times x minus x bar. So y we don't know but y bar we have 120 equal to r is 0.9 standard deviation of y is 12 upon 4 times x minus x bar is 20. Okay. Now y minus 120 equal to this is 2.7.9 into 3 x into x 2.7 x minus this is 2.7 into 20 it gives us 27 the 14 2 to the 4 and 5 54. Right? It is 54. So now y equal to 2.7x minus 54 plus this 120. Okay. If this 120 it is minus will go to another side of the equal sign will become positive one. Okay. So our equation will be y equal to 2.7x this one will be plus 66 okay so this will be our second equation right so 66 120 minus 54 will give us 66 this is positive right so these two are our equations okay so we are asked to estimate two regression equation. So we have these two regression equation. This one is the first one and this one is the second one. Okay. So first thing we have done. Right. So now we have to find out sales when advertisement is rupees 50. Okay. So just solve it now. Now we don't know the don't need this information. So just rub it. Okay. Okay. Now this is second. Sales when advertisement is rupees 50 crores. Okay. So we assumed sales as Y. Okay. So advertisement is X and the sales is Y for us. Right. So this one. So we are given here Y. Sales when advertisement is, sorry, we are given X. X is given that is. 50. Advertisement is given 50. Means X is known. Here means that is sales when advertisement is rupees 50. Means X is known. Okay. So, we will put the value of x, this is y, sorry, x is known, value of y on x, okay. The one which is known is independent here, right. So, we have to find out the dependent one. So equation will become y on x. So we have y on x equation here. This one is. So means 
x is known, so we will put the value of y on x. Okay. So, so substitute or substitute the value of x on equation second we get what we get y equal to 2.7 2.7 x we have 50 into 50 plus 66 okay so y equal to this into this gives us 5 7 the 35 5 to the 10 135 plus 66 y equal to 201 crores Okay, so our second answer is 201 crore. Okay, so sale we have 201 crore at advertisement of rupees 50 crore. Okay, when a company do advertisement of 50 crore, so it can avail or it can have the sale of rupees 102 crores rupees. Okay. The similarly we will find out the amount of advertisement for sales of rupees 150. Okay. Now the third one. So third we have Advertisement for sales of rupees one lakh fifty crores. Okay, so for one lakh fifty crores rupees, what will be the amount of advertisement? So here. Non is y that is one fifty. Okay, so put the value of y on equation one. We get equation we have this one x equal to 0.3 y value of y is into 150 0.3 into 150 minus 16 so x equal to 45 minus 16 so x is this is 40 sorry 45 minus 16 is 29 rupees. Okay. So this is our third answer. Okay. So we need advertisement of 29 crore rupees to attain or achieve sales of rupees 150 crores and we need 201 crores of sales for meeting the cost of advertisement of rupees 50 uh, crores rupees and we have these two regression equation x on y and y on x okay so friend when all informations are given so we can estimate the regression equation as well as find the value of non so friend if we are given all the information related to these two equation we can estimate these equation and also find out the value of dependent variable or unknown variable on the basis of non variable okay so this was the third case 
सो थैंक यू वेरी मच फॉर वॉचिंग दिस वीडियो है